What? Hi. Hi. You're my adorable dog, aren't you? I'm filming a show. Can you uh, come back a little later? Thank you. Uh, yes. Stay down. I gotta do my show. Sit. Awesome. No, I'm kidding. Uh, hey everyone, Cameron here with Wolf One, and today I wanted to talk about my YouTube story. Uh, I started YouTube back in 2007. I made uh, uh, Recycle Now, uh, and that little activist film I made for school, actually. Uh, and believe me, the pictures turned out a lot better when I turned it into my teacher than when I turned it into YouTube and it got all fuzzy and cruddy. But that was like one of the first videos I ever made. It wasn't very good. It was kind of choppy. The music sounded great, but people didn't really like the visual because it was blurry and megapixeled like crazy. So I kind of didn't do too much with YouTube after that. I was just kind of like throwing it out there to see what would happen. Didn't really anything happen. And I just kind of let it chill. I got onto YouTube every once in a while to watch a few films. I was big into mediocre films. Um, I watched a lot of film malicious, a lot of like, oh, Machinima. I was huge into Machinima back then. I watched those guys all the time. And I didn't really branch anywhere else besides that, besides gaming and stuff like that. And then in 2009, I kind of scooped up. I was freaking out about some birds. Anyway, um, I was huge into like gaming stuff, and that was my world. That's what I did all the time. And so. After that, I didn't really do anything until about 2009 in the spring again where I picked up being creative again with videos. And that's when I started the Average Saturday crew. And the Average Saturday crew was a lot of fun. I did it with my dorm guys. But the only problem with doing it with guys in your dorm is that once the semester's over, everyone heads to different parts of the country slash world. So I lost the Average Saturday crew. And then over the summer, I started making cartoons little short film cartoons and I didn't have like editing software for cartoons or anything so I just kinda like used Microsoft Paint <laughs> and kinda like little 8 16 bit cartoon color things and those were interesting and I voiced everything myself and you can search out there I doubt you'll find those films anymore I deleted them off my own channel so they're not around anymore and you know I did that for a little while, then I realized this isn't bringing any views in, you know. Why, why am I not getting any views? Well, I realized something. I wasn't using the YouTube community. I wasn't stretching out to other YouTubers at all. Like, I was watching videos, but I wasn't leaving comments or rating them or favoriting videos. I wasn't doing any of that. So that's what I started to do. I commented on videos. I befriended other people. I chatted with everyone, learned as much as I could about all sorts of people across the world. And that brought my channel a little bit of success. Um, of course, I didn't have any content, really. I was like in this side of the world of people who make random videos, and then the rest of the people over here who actually had good content. So my goal was, i got to find a way to get over here. So in uh, the fall, I started, you know, using my noggin decided that I needed to start making good content. So I made The Fear. Uh, I wrote, edited, and produced The Fear with two of my other friends. It only took three of us to make. Uh, it's kind of difficult at times only having three people to make a, a video like that. But we pulled it off, and I think it turned out pretty good. It's one of my favorite films and videos I've ever done. Um, but the thing about doing videos like that is that I can only really pump out with the time I have with school and everything. I can only really do one of those like once a month. And the thing about only putting out a video once a month is that in the YouTube world, that's like a year. Like, so they put out a video, you love it, and you're like, okay, I want more. And then you wait a month, and you're like, wait a second, are these, these guys dead? Like, did they just like make the one and disappear? And that's kind of what happens. Like, I mean, the station did it, and like, they put out all this content, and all of a sudden they were gone. Like, it was like, is the station dead? And everyone was freaking out. And then they put something out, and we're like, oh, okay, you know, we're, the community is almost fickle, I guess is the word. Um, you know, you got to continually grab the attention, and 
that's, that's what I knew and that's what I feel like a lot of people knew. So I started making shout out videos. Uh, I call it Shout Out Wednesday. Pretty simple, pretty straightforward. For those of you who don't know, I pick random viewers of mine who leave comments saying I want a shout out. I give them a shout out and I do it on Wednesdays. That's, that's really all it is. It's kind of simple. I enjoy it. But the cool thing about Shout Out Wednesday is it doesn't take very much time. I spend maybe an hour or two doing Shout Out Wednesday, and I can still do everything else I want to do. I can make my short films, I can go to school, I can work, I can do everything. And I can continually get more subscribers and more views through Shout Out Wednesday because I'm putting something out on a weekly basis. Uh, also, with just doing this every time show, is like if I want to do other things as well, um, I can. I can do whatever I want. Uh, I've been doing vlogs. I've been doing other little short skits still. I still have films that I've been writing. And instead of only taking a month to do, they've been taking longer. But, you know, it happens. Uh, but I've really, really enjoyed the YouTube community. I've learned so much, uh, like in the marketing world, in the film world. Uh, even in my own field that I enjoy, the science world, I'm a biology major. Uh, I like science. I like doing things and learning things that way. That's why I use hand motions. But, um, yeah, I've learned a lot from YouTube. Uh, some of my first subscribers were Oakland TV, uh, Mediocre Films. I'm, Mediocre Films, when he subscribed to me, I was like, whoa, who's this guy? And then when I watched his stuff, I think one of the first videos I ever saw from him was $2 Hugs. And I loved that video. That was the funniest thing in the world to me. And I've been a Mediocre Films fan ever, ever since he subscribed to me. Like, I had no idea who he was. Because, you know, how would I know if, you know, he wouldn't have contacted me? So, I mean, that's like one of the biggest things I can say to young YouTubers is, you know, contact people, hit the, the add as friend button, leave a comment on their wall saying, hey, I like your stuff. Watch other people's videos and leave comments on their videos and stuff, you know. Favorite them, send them to your friends, you know. Share all this stuff that's on YouTube. There's so much content out there and so many very creative people that just want to be heard. And that's another uh, thing that I like Shout Out Wednesday for. Um, another famous subscriber of mine is Toby Turner. Um, I don't know if you actually watch my stuff, Toby, but it's cool that you're subscribed to me. I'm sure every once in a while you see my Shout Out Wednesdays blop up, and that's cool. But um, I'm subscribed to all your channels. I love what you do and your editing and stuff. You're very, very, very entertaining. Um, but, yeah, that's, that's really about it. Um, I've tried to do my YouTube story like five times today alone. But the dog kept barking, or I realized I had been rambling for like 20 minutes about it. But that's really, it's really simple of what, I, what I've done with YouTube. I started in 2007, did activist stuff, did cartoons, did random skits, started doing short films, started doing a weekly show. And here I sit with my 500 subscribers, happy as can be, enjoying what I do. It's good times. Uh, Rock on awesome, I guess, everybody. Um, like I always try to do every week. Uh, thanks for watching, everybody. We'll see you next week. <laughs> hey, guys, real quick. I just want to say thank you to all of my subscribers for making my show the minor success that it is. Uh, please do me a favor and uh, hit the subscribe button, hit the friend button, leave a comment down below, and uh, please go check out my older videos. Uh, I enjoyed making them, so I hope you'll enjoy watching them. But, uh, yeah, like I did earlier. See you guys next time. <laughs>